All right, how's it going, everyone? This is video 20 out of 22. We are almost done of the Book of Tokens. Here is the image of the sun. All right, let's get started. The Meditation on Resh. I am the face which shineth forever, which shineth ever and before which the darkness hasteth away. I am the white brilliance of the head which is not a head. I am the profuse giver of all abundance. Yet, though I am the greatest of the great, I am also the smallest of the small. I am the depth as well as the height, the without as well as that which is within. For in me are all opposites united. I am the glory of the eternal source, and I am the foundation of the kingdom of the ageless result. In Asya, I am the sun, whose rays are the spring of life and action. The sun in this material world is the father of all bodies therein, and the cause of every movement. Yet, though I am thy son, I am also every son. Lose not the spirit and the symbol, O seeker for light. Beneath the wings of the great sun thou dwellest, and this is the sun whereof the prophet spake. But unto you that fear my name shall the sun of righteousness arise with healing and its wings. Yea, and that day shalt thou sing unto the Lord a new song, a song of rejoicing in his beautiful countenance, the face of thine own true self. Comment on Resh. R-E-S-H. Pronounced R-E-S-H. Pronounced Resh. Transcribed as R, the number 200, meaning face the Collective Intelligence The first section rehearses various names of Keter, the crown. These are Resha Ha-Ora, R-I-S-H-A, H-V-V-R-H, The White Head, Tath-Zal, T-H-T-H-Z-L, The Profuse Giver, Nechuda Peshut, N-Q-D-H-P-S-H-B-T-H, the small point and Olun, Oliun, O L I V N, the most high, Oliun. The end of the paragraph refers to the path of Resh, or Resh, the 30th path of wisdom called the collective intelligence, which joins Hod, glory or splendor, to Yesod, foundation. Asya is the lowest of the four Kabbalistic worlds. This section begins with the attribution of the physical sun to the letter Resh. It goes on to warn us that the physical sun is not to be confounded with the spiritual sun. This section is reminiscent of the great Egyptian symbol of the winged disc. The key word is kanafim, K-N-P-I-M, wings, which adds up to 200, the numeral value of the letter Resh. Compare this with the conclusion of the Rosicrucian Fama Fraternitatis, which ends Sub Umbra Alarum Tuarum Jehovah, under the shadow of thy wings, Jehovah. Jehovah being an alternate of the Tetragrammaton in some traditions. In the last paragraph, the key word is the noun she'er, or shir, S-H-I-R, a song. Hmm. This has the same numeral value, 510, as the letter name resh, R-I-S-H, and is spelt with the same letters in a different order. The word face in the last line is a direct play upon the meaning of the letter name. All right, that's it for this one. Thanks for tuning in. 
I hope you have a good rest of the day, good rest of the week. Thanks for stopping by, and I hope I see you in the next one. Take care.